Top of the morning, this on OG. Praise be to the most high. Shout out to my subscribers, man. Hope everybody blessed up. Yes, sir, man. Salute to the realms, man. Yeah, we're back, man. Just early morning out here, man. Early morning routine, man. You know what I'm saying? Early morning routine. Been up early, like always, man. Got an off day. Got some shit to take care of, but that's it, man. Say what's up, girl. Y'all already know who that is. That's Stormy, a.k.a. Lil' Mama. Yeah, this right here, man, this gonna be for my newbies, man, for all my new guys coming in, clean water. Fresh kibble, man, with the goat pie in there. Yeah, man. That's how we doing it, man. It's early morning. Well, man, I just wanted, uh, let's say, man, peace and bless to everybody. Hope everybody good in the community, man. Hope everybody's still living. And if you're, if you're a sucker, hope your ass got solid. But, you know, hit that bell, man. But, um, I want to talk about having a routine, man. You know, to the new guys, if you're a novice and you're going to really rock with these bulldogs, man, you got to, um, you got to get you a routine and you got to stay dedicated, bro. You know, dedication is the real key to doing anything, to be a good dog, man, to be a good uh, basketball player, to be a good, you know, hip hop artist, whatever it is you doing, even for the females, they modeling, they dancing, whatever they doing, you got to stay dedicated to your crowd. Same thing with these dogs, man, you know, um, I was chopping it up with a fella dog man on the phone one day and, and, and uh, I had him on speaking. He heard me raking the yard. He said, damn, that sound good. I said, what's that, bro? He said, you raking that fucking yard, ain't you? I said, hell yeah. He said, hell yeah, that shit sound, he said, that shit sound beautiful. So that let me know that he really know what this shit about. And that's what it's about, man. It's about dedication, bro. You got to put that fucking work in, man. You know what I'm saying? So when guys throw shade and they hate on guys, you know what I mean? Because they don't like guys, whether it's color or whatever it is. And I know these people have been, uh, they got longevity in the game and they've been consistent. Man, you can't do nothing but salute. They put in their work. They being dedicated. And, you know, that's how we separate the good from the motherfucking bad. You know what I'm saying? Those who stay dedicated to the crab. You know, it's, it's yeah, okay, you can have some beautiful dogs with nice-ass pedigrees, but at the end of the day is this, how long you going to last? How long the fuck you gonna last? Is you gonna be doing it when, the, when everything is good? Or what about when niggas ain't buying your dogs? Then, then, then what you gonna do? When you got too many dogs and you, and you never really had to learn how to take care of your hounds, then what you gonna do? Because you wasn't dedicated enough to really do your homework on some shit that really, to you, it was just really something to get into, you really didn't love it. You know, so to my newbies and my novice, man, I wanna make sure that first thing, man, the first thing to know is you got to stay dedicated. And staying dedicated is getting you an everyday routine. See these leaves, man? I rake these bitches up every day. That's one little pile. That's one little goddamn pile. It look probably big, but it ain't really big. You know what I'm saying? That's another little pile. But I get that shit up every day, man, waking up. You know what I'm saying? Regardless, he and that about nah, no. Regardless of how cold it is or how hot it is outside, I got to get this shit up. You know, if you really gonna get in the game, you gotta be dedicated even with your life. Like even with working, you gotta have a schedule, man, that's gonna fit your life if you're gonna be fucking with these dogs. Because it's all about being dedicated. It's gonna take some time. It's gonna take some time. So everything you do, man, you're gonna have to stay dedicated to the craft. You know what I'm saying? With having a daily routine with your dog. You know, you just can't do this shit on, okay, I feel like today I'm gonna shoot a video, I'm gonna work my house. Hell no, it gotta be a part of your life. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. Bulldog man, you know, is a motherfucking way of life. It's a lifestyle. What's up, Miami? What's up, man? What's up with you? What's up with you? You know, a dog is just like having a child. I ain't no fur mommy, as you can see. And guess what? For that boy was talking that shit, man, I keep plenty motherfucking, uh, plenty goddamn, uh, bedding for my hounds, bro. Plenty bedding. They knock that shit out. They'll learn. But anyway, you know what I'm saying? Look at that. Staying dedicated, knowing that every week I got to go get two bells of hay to keep my hounds warm, to keep them comfortable, you know, to keep them mentally together. You know what I'm saying? Staying dedicated to knowing that I got to get out here and hustle and work, that I got to keep money that I can bury to for good dog food to feed my dogs good things to make their coat shine and make them healthy and keep them active. 
you know, that type of thing, grinding to make sure that I can get that red cell and I got all the goat powder and I got raw feed and I can do all the shit that I want to do for my fucking house, staying dedicated that I put what I love to do before the little shit like maybe smoking weed or cigarettes or beer. Even if you do that shit, it ain't no knock at your fucking dough, but you got to stay dedicated to these dogs enough that they going to come first, man. That's what it's about, and that's, that's the teaching on these hounds I want to get back to. So that's going to let you know if you really want to fuck with picking up shit every day, all day. Going out here when it's cold as fuck outside, first thing in the morning, but you got to go to work. But guess what? Them dogs need water, too. Yeah, they got to have water, too, because they ain't going to get that shit they sell. Yeah, see, and everybody in their kennels now, I mean, their house right now, you know why? Because I don't work to everybody. I don't work to everybody. He jumped out. Some jumped out, so he out. But she just shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Exercising them all day. Look, and that diamond. Hey, boy, I went back to that diamond high performance. That boy coat shining like a bitch. It's shining like a bitch. I ain't gonna lie. That diamond high performance got his coat shining like a bitch, man. If y'all, I don't know if y'all can see it. Debo, what's up, boy? What's up, boy? Yeah, man, it got to shine like a bitch, man. Y'all like that, though. But, yeah, just shit like that, staying dedicated to learning about what your dog need for us to get their coat together. I remember when I bought Debo on the scene, his coat was raggedy as fuck. Yeah, but, you know, just dedicated, man, to learning and studying about diet, what your dog need, what your dog don't need, learning about protein, learning about fat, staying dedicated to the crab. Let me get up on his coat a little bit. He might have got a little bit dirty, but that bitch shining. That bitch shining. Yeah, that bitch shining. But, man, staying dedicated to everything. You know, spending your money on the proper chain setups, things that you need, man. You know, that's, that's what it's about. Getting up every day, you know, loving this shit. Keep it. Ain't no shit on the ground no well, man. You know, that, that type of shit. What's up, boy? What's up, boy? What's up, boy? They be talking shit about each web. This motherfucker, he a fool. What's up, boy? He a fool with it, though, man. But just staying dedicated, man. Regardless when people talk about your hounds, man. You know, you're not getting down, man. You know, just staying dedicated. Even when you ain't making no money right now. You know, still, still on it. What's up, girl? Yeah, she in there cooling, man. That's Storm and that's Lil Mama. You know, she be cooling. But it's all about dedication, man. If you're going to be a dog, man. You know what I'm saying? Because that's going to let you know where you'll be at 10 years from now. You know what I mean? Staying dedicated. You know what I'm saying? Because it ain't how long you go. It's how strong you go. And it ain't what's on you. It's in you. You know, this shit got to be really in you, man. You know, one month can don't stop no show. One month can don't stop no motherfucking show. Nobody can stop me. And nobody can stop y'all. So anybody that's fucking with me, you know, shit, one month can don't stop no fucking show, man. You know, that's word of the day. And that's real spill. Holy fear. Deal. Shout out to the whole dirty South, man. But that's how we rocking out here, man. We just trying to bull it out, live a good ass life, and stand dedicated to what we do. Stand dedicated to being fucking free. You know, I stay dedicated to being free, not letting fuck niggas throw me off the course. You know, I talk a little shit on this YouTube shit, but ain't shit popping. You know, cause half of these motherfuckers ain't worth the squeeze of the juice and and, and shit like that, man. If it ain't about about no money, about my family, it's all motherfucking play with me. You know, long as a motherfucker don't ever cross that line. But I stay about these bulldogs. That's that's what I love to do. And you can't you can't got them get no money in the penitentiary. You can't got them take care of these hounds. You can't breed nothing in the penitentiary. You know, so just staying dedicated, man, to loving these dogs and staying out off that fuck shit. You know, cause there's a bunch of fuck shit. The devil stay busy, man. But you know, this is for one of my subscribers that want to know about the future. You know, homie, it's like this, bro. Only God know the future. Everything in my life, homie, is God willing. You know, he's the best of planners, man. You know, that's how I really live, bro. You know, I ain't no superhero. You know, I ain't no perfect I ain't no perfect person, man. Like I say, I cuss like a sailor sometimes. But, you know, at the end of the day, man, I believe that, you know, God God is the judge. And I, and I try to do right. I treat people how I want to be treated, man. I stay dedicated to that. Even staying dedicated to shit like that. Just staying dedicated is the key, man. If you stay dedicated to doing good things, you know, stay dedicated to your program, you know, shit like that. Stay dedicated to your circle, you know what I'm saying? Making sure that iron sharp and iron being your brother keeper, shit gonna work out, man. But just stay dedicated. Whatever you do, man, if you're gonna get in this shit, know that ain't nothing gonna come easy, bro. Nothing ain't gonna come easy. Ain't no shortcuts in this shit, bro. You know, just gotta stay dedicated, bro. And with staying dedicated, man, You'll reap your reward. Knowledge is power. Stay solid. It's the movement. Until next time, man. Y'all boys be safe. We out of here.